Hey, what's going on guys? It's ETA Prime back here again with another LaunchBox news video. Today we're going to be talking about some new features in the unofficial beta releases. Now as of making this video, we're on LaunchBox 8.2 beta three, but this could change at any time because there's no real set number of betas before the official release comes out. If you're interested in checking out the new beta features, it's very easy to set up. I did a video on it, but I'll show you real quick. Go ahead and start LaunchBox from the tools menu. Scroll down until we see options. From within options, we're going to choose updates. Make sure check for updates is marked. Make sure update to beta releases is marked also. Now that we have both of these checked, we're going to click OK. I'm going to close LaunchBox and then restart it. From now on, when you start up LaunchBox, you'll get a prompt if there's an update available for betas. Go ahead and download it. It'll automatically install and you'll be up and running the unofficial LaunchBox betas. So there was a really good reason I showed you guys how to update to the latest betas. We have some really big news here. Today, we want to share with you the latest addition to LaunchBox, LaunchBox Next, a totally new revamped interface available for free users and paid users. As of making this video, it's only available in the unofficial betas right now, so go ahead, get that beta downloaded, and give this thing a try. It is beautiful, and it's super fast. If we look right up here, we have the option for LaunchBox.next. We're going to go ahead and start this. LaunchBox.next is now available for free for all users. It's a rehaul of the main LaunchBox interface. Please keep in mind that this is still early and still in development. Would you like to try it now? I'm going to go ahead and click yes. And this is LaunchBox Next. As you can see, it's a totally new interface. As of making this video, there's a lot of features that still need to be implemented but they're being worked on as we speak. I think it looks really good and it's actually really fast. So I'm just gonna go through here a little bit. 3DO, 2600, 5200, Jaguar, Lynx, Daphne, Odyssey 2. We'll go back to Atari 2600, scroll down. As you can see, it is really snappy. So we can go ahead and launch a game through here if we want to, we'll just go Super Baseball click play, or we can edit just like we would inside a launch box. So that's launch box next. Keep an eye out on the forums. I definitely recommend at least giving it a try. This is really awesome news and it's great to see a new interface for free users using launch box. Now I want to show you a couple of new themes that I found on the launch box forum. The first one being arcane by wall machine. This one is beautiful and it's really snappy. I'll just scroll through here real quick, head over to super Nintendo. As you can see, I do have some box art on the top and the bottom. The top is my favorite. The bottom are games that I have in my games directory. You can play them directly from the main menu here if you want to do that. Or we can go right in here. And it looks really nice. We do have video support here. I think this is a very nice theme and I definitely recommend trying it out. The next theme I wanted to show you is called Big Flicks by Snake Eater over at the LaunchBox forums. This was actually released in 2017, but he recently updated it February 19, 2018. You might notice, looks a lot like Netflix, and I think that's what he was going for, the Big Flicks name. It's very snappy. I really do like the way this one looks. And one of my favorite parts about this is sliding box art. I'll go into something that I have video snaps or game videos for. As you can see, it'll start playing your game video. And that's what I mean by sliding box art. I think it looks really good. Back out of here. And we'll head over to Neo Geo real quick. This is another system I have all the snaps for.
So I think it looks really good. If you're into this, links are in the description. Go ahead and test them out. So that's it for this video, guys. We really appreciate you watching. I definitely recommend going to check out LaunchBox next. Just enable the LaunchBox betas, and you'll have this up and running in no time. Big shout out to the theme developers out there. There's a lot of great stuff on the forum. I wish I could cover it all in one video, but it would be a long video. If you guys could, hit that like button and subscribe. And like always, thanks for watching.